Hey, what's going on, guys? My name's Oscar Mikey, and today, uh, today we're playing Subnautica. So I've, I've been aware of this game ever since its announcement and release and all that stuff. It's been out for a little while. It's actually kind of an older game. But yeah, let's let's get out of the main menu and let's just go right into the game. I'll explain a little more as we get into the game. So yeah, I, I knew about this game from day one. I was aware that it, were, that it got announced and released and people were playing it and enjoying it. I always thought it looked like an interesting concept, very different from all other survival games. But um, I've mentioned it one, once or twice. I've mentioned it once or twice in some other videos. I'm actually like deathly afraid of open water. I have that <laughs> that phobia, what, whatever it's called, thalassophobia, I think. Uh, yeah, I saw the movie Jaws when I was like seven or eight years old and it scarred me for life, man. Now I'm terrified of open water. <laughs> I was even scared of like swimming pools for a while when I was younger. Oh god, this doesn't look safe at all. Oh shit! Okay. Um, but yeah, I thought I would play this game today. And I saw, you know what, it was relatively affordable on Steam. And I did always think it looked interesting. And I just kind of want to play it, you know? Use the fire extinguisher. <laughs> Aim at the base of the fire! We're good, we're good. Okay, crisis averted. So yeah, we're just hopping right in here. The story is, if you've never played this game before like me, that uh, your ship, you're a space traveler, and your ship crashes on this alien world. Minor head trauma. This is considered an optimal outcome. This PDA has now rebooted in emergency mode with one directive to keep you alive on an alien world. Please refer to the data bank for detailed survival advice. Okay, okay. Tab to open or close the PDA. Yeah. Cool. So, yeah, we, uh... You crash land on an alien world and you have to survive. This place is like 99% water or whatever. Fabricator. So this is what you use to craft food and refined materials and stuff. That's pretty cool. And like this game is pretty outside of what I typically do. Like action-packed FPS kinds of games. But it just looked like too good to pass up. There's something over there. Okay, zero signs of human life. There's something over there. But yeah, this is my nightmare. <laughs> this is like nightmare fuel for me. I would rather die than be in a situation like this. There's something else over there. It looks like it's moving. Um, But yeah, this is a really unique game. Really unique game. Very creative idea for a game, and I just wanted to... I wanted to be a part of it, you know? I wanted to explore it for myself. And just vibe with you guys. So this is not going to be like a regular series. I know you guys are super into Zero Sievert. And some of the other videos I do. I have a couple of Tarkov videos that... Got a lot of views. Like, the action-packed stuff, that's going to be my regular thing. But this, I'm thinking about just making like a weekend thing. And I don't know how you guys are going to receive it. Just let me know in the comments what you think about it and if you want to see more. Like, I don't want to keep making these videos, these Subnautica videos, if it's, like, not worth my time or if you guys don't want to see it. Oh, copper. So let me know in the comments what you think. Copper? Oh. Of course. <laughs> That's nice. This is already looking really cool. I'm... Oh, shit. Running out of air. Oh! Okay, we're good. Holy! Caught some air there. Just kind of launched myself out. And I heard the music in this game is wonderful. And I did listen to a little bit before I jumped in. It's a, it's a really pretty game. Like, you can't deny. If you're like me and you're afraid of open water, you still can't deny that this is like a beautiful, just really atmospheric game. What the fuck? Oh! Okay, I've seen those before. That's like a giant squid-like thing. They're 
passive. They don't attack you or anything. Oh, shit. I gotta be careful. I can't go too deep. I don't think I have, like, an oxygen tank yet. Wow. Yeah. Whoa. This is... This is actually really cool. I'm, like, slightly uncomfortable, but it's cool, man. Hey, what's up, buddy? You're not gonna hurt me, right? We're cool. We're buds. You got something growing on your, on your ass there. You might want to get that checked out. Oxygen. Oh, goddammit. Okay, I really gotta get, like, an oxygen tank. We gotta, like, start looking around for materials and crafting stuff now. To get our bearings, get ourselves set up for the future, you know? Get ourselves set up for success. Yeah, so these Subnautica videos are going to be much more chill. I don't have, like, a clock on this. I don't know how long I'm going to make these episodes. Probably a little bit longer than typical uh, videos. Well, but my typical videos are, like, 45 minutes long these days. <laughs> I used to do much shorter videos, but you guys seem to like the long plays. But yeah, we're just gonna vibe. These weekend Subnautica videos are just gonna be like... Just you and me chilling, vibing. Trying to survive in this this ocean. So like... What do we... What should we do first? Why don't we... I don't know if these things are... They're probably friendly, but just to be safe, I'm gonna go back in the thing. Escape pod. So what do we have to do first? Right. Data bank, blueprints, okay. Pair tool, inhaled scanner, air pumps. Okay, this is just like a glossary of all stuff in game. Um, are there like objectives? Beacon manager, blueprints. Okay. So, like, um, damaged radio. Use repair tool. I do have, okay, I've got the fabricator. Equipment. Standard O2 tank, so I need three titanium for that. Fins, trans, translate vertical limb movements underwater into forward thrust, enhance swim speed by approximately 15%. That'll be nice. Fire extinguisher, uh, pipes, floating air pump. Let's get, okay, here we go. These are the tools that I need. I think I... Those are all important. Okay, so I guess I should... I need to get the scanner and the repair tool, I guess. Flashlight would be handy, too. So I need batteries for a couple of these. Um, so how do I, how do I make batteries, basic materials, okay, that's just kind of refining stuff, that's a battery, acid mushroom, I have copper, that's good, um, and I need acid mushrooms, okay, And I need titanium. So I need acid, mushrooms, and titanium for now. Oh, oh god. It's so uncomfortable. Yeah, I don't- I really don't like that things can, like, swim underneath me and around me and stuff. Super uncomfortable. Table coral. Look at that. Can I use this underwater? Oh, I can! Oh my god, I can I can push myself around with it. That's so cool. <laughs> I'm going to use it all up. I'm just going to keep it. Oh, what's in here? Sea glide fragment. Oh, damn it. I can't stay under here for long at all, eh? So I got to start thinking about food, too. My food is pretty dang low. Um... Oh, acid mushrooms. Yes. 
I might want to find some more copper. I only have one. Limestone. That has ore in it, right? Titanium. I need titanium. Eat something. Okay. Yeah, I'm getting kind of hungry. Any more rocks? I need those ores. Oxygen. God damn. I gotta be really careful. Like, I'm getting... Oh, God. I'm getting way too deep. I love to go deep. Whoa. Oh. New creature discovered. Utilizing alien resources is a proven survival strategy. Okay. Um, it's getting dark. But everything is lighting up. Look at these pretty plants. Writhing weed? This game is really nice looking. Very pretty. And also very scary. Getting sidetracked again. Uh, uh. Okay. Um. Oh, there's a little fish. I think I can make food out of these little fish. Hello, keeper. So, if I remember right, I can go back in the escape pod and then use the fabricator to make food. Yeah. I can make water too. Oh, from the bladder fish. Yeah, I'm gonna need water. So I'll make that. Sweet. Okay, cooked fish. Cooked peeper. Sorry, buddy. The fabricator cooks small organisms while disposing of the skeletal structure, bodily fluids, and internal organs, thus rendering them safe for human consumption. Oh, okay. Cured, so I can make cured fish? Cured peeper preserved in salt, a healthy and nutritious meal, dehydrating but keeps well? Oh, so if you want to store a lot of food. Reminiscent of jerky, dehydrating but keeps... Okay. Tools. Air bladder. Emergency flotation device, chemical reaction produces lighter than air gas for fast personal buoyancy. Okay, so it's like an underwater airbag that you deploy if you need to get to the surface really fast, I guess. That's what it sounds like. Okay, I can make my battery now. Sweet. New blueprint. Power cell. Uh, two batteries and one silicone rubber for that. Bladder fish. Yeah. So these are all the different things I can craft. This eventually when I make a base, I can craft these things. All needs titanium. Uh, right. Okay, this is my inventory. I don't have any gear on me, so I need to make all my gear. Um, Cooked peeper, consume that. Wow, that did not give us a lot of food at all. I consume that, how much? Okay, a little bit, not too bad. Uh, let's fabricate. What were we trying to make again? I got sidetracked again. Um... No. Personal. Right. Scanner. Okay, here we go. Repair tool, flashlight, survival knife, your bladder. Yeah. Equipment. Here we go. Standard O2 tank. Okay, we need that. I can make the uh, scanner right now. It's going to use up my titanium, but... Okay. We need the scanner too. The scanner can be used to synthesize blueprints from salvage technology and to record alien biological data. Cool. Okay. So what if I okay, I can change my binds like that. Cool. Don't need the fire extinguisher. It's neat that I can move around in water with it, but <laughs> besides that, I don't know. Cool. Um, I do need a little bit more food and water. So let's go down and get some... Oops. I mean, we need to get more titanium. Oh, okay. This makes me uncomfortable. I don't like that one bit. <laughs> it's 
super dark out there now. Oh, wow. Oh, man. Detecting increased local radiation levels. Oh, no. Trend is consistent with damage to the Aurora's drive core sustained during planet fall. Okay. Uh, well, I guess I better be brave and go into the water. You guys don't want to watch me just stand on top of this thing the whole time, do you? Oh, God. Okay, here we go. Oh. So uncomfortable. Oh. Okay, we need titanium. We gotta make that O2 tank, right? I want to stay underwater for longer. Oh, we need that little guy. That's a... Uh, the bladderfish for water, right? Oh! I've seen these before. They, uh, they make air bubbles. Yeah. Thanks, buddy. Daytime again. The day-night cycle is fast, thankfully. Pick another acid mushroom, why not? I need... Titanium. Where's the titanium? Uh, they're hidden in those rocks. Oh. New creature discovered. No! Damn it. Okay, I can craft... I can refine titanium from salvage, can I? I think that's the thing. That looks like salvage. Metal salvage? Yep. There's lots of junk. Human beings have been on this planet for all of like 12 seconds and we're already littering. Isn't that inspiring? <laughs> um... Let's see if we can find some more salvage around here. I don't know how much titanium that one piece is going to give us. I need three. Where's the... I've kind of lost... Oh, it's over there. Okay. Oh, there's one. I think that's salvage. Yep. Come here. Come here, you. Glorious piece of... Piece of garbage. Piece of ocean waste. That's cool. Okay, I've seen these little guys before. Loader. Hey, little guy. <laughs> oh, that's funny. <laughs> that's cool. Um, any more salvage around in this, like, immediate area? Oh, what's that? Limestone chunk. Scan. Back down. <laughs> That's cool. You can really launch yourself. Yes, titanium. Uh, could do with one more. I used one up to make the, uh, the scanner, right? And here's a little rock. Copper, that's good too. Giant coral tubes. I can't, I don't have time to scan stuff. Just give me a titanium. No. Oh god. Oh, this might be the end. No. No! Oh. Okay. You know what, let's just see what we got. Let's go back in. And we'll refine that waste or that salvage. Uh, yep. Yeah. Wow, you get four titanium from one piece of salvage? That's badass. Standard O2 tank. There we go. And. We can make the floating air pump now. I don't know if I want that. 
at the moment. Cooked fish. I do need a little more food. Cook the boomerang. Make some water from the bladder fish. Cool. Okay. Uh, so is that in my inventory now? No, it's on me. Sweet. Uh, okay, what else can we make? I need to outfit myself, right? High capacity O2 tank. Okay. So I need glass, titanium, and silver for that. The fins would be nice, so I need two silicone rubbers. Let's make those next. Silicone rubbers. Creepvine seed clusters. Okay, we need the glowing yellow thingies. If you guys have any advice or tips or anything like that for me in the comments, go ahead and leave it. No spoilers, though. Hello. I'm going to eat you up. Yeah, no spoilers. I'm kind of just, uh... I'm here for the adventure. And I don't want it to be spoiled. Mm, got some quartz. Lots of little... Uh, minerals in here. That's cool. Ooh. No thanks. I'm not going to go anywhere near that. Okay, we're getting pretty deep now. 60, almost 70 meters? 70 meters. Whoa. Okay, that guy's aggressive. Keeper. Uh, wow. This is really pretty, guys. This game is really pretty. Um, we need to find those creep vines. 30 seconds. Getting a little deeper than I feel comfortable. It takes a long time to get up to the surface. So I don't know if this is the way I want to be going. Yeah, yeah. Those creep vines are on seaweed. Is that... Can I find uh, the things over there? Because they're on the seaweed. Oh, there, there's some, I think. Yeah, that's it. That's what I need. Oh. I think those are aggressive, though. Oh, shush. Oh. Can I? Yes. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Okay, I'm leaving. Sweet. I might get one or two more. I don't want to have to come back here straight away. Might as well stock up. Life on this planet grows in unusually distinct and diverse inventory full shit. Okay. Study recommended. They're actually huge. They take up a lot of space. Wow. Okay. Man, I could really use those fins. I feel like I'm just... I'm going so slow right now. <laughs> 80 meters. If I get too close to those things, will they attack? Making me nervous. Alright. Uh, yep. Personal equipment. No, I need to refine it first. No, not lubricant. Silicone rubber. There we go. And... There, fins. Awesome. Okay. I don't mind. Keeps me alive. What do I care? Uh, I've already got a scanner. Repair tool. I wonder what I should build next. Flashlight, maybe? Survival knife. That probably makes more sense. I 
I still have some of those creep vine things. Can make some more silicone rubbers. That's perfect. Equipment. No. Tools? Yeah. Survival knife. Weapons were removed from standard survival blueprints following the massacre on Abraxas Prime. Oh no. The knife remains the only exception. Oh no. Okay, so the knife is the only weapon I have. That's interesting. Repair tool. I need cave sulfur for that. Is that something I can refine? Doesn't look like it. I can make lubricant. Glass. I'm going to need glass. So I need a glass for something. Titanium. How's my inventory looking? Okay, these are huge. I think I'm going to... Is there any storage on board here? Storage. There we go. Okay, I'll... I'll just put those in there. Put the ores away. Keep the knife. Put the fire extinguisher. Put those. Store all this junk. Oh, I have a cooked boomerang fish that I haven't eaten yet. There we go. Drink the water too. Um, I actually need a little bit of sustenance. So I'll take those. Composed of multiple organisms in symbiosis? Life cycle unknown. Weird. Oh, I have a bunch of water here. Nutrient block? Oh, I guess this is like survival materials that were left in there. Consume that. Consume. Oh my god. Okay, I'm overclocked. Use fabricator, sustenance. Cook the peeper. We'll just stock up on a little bit of food and water for our adventures. Cool. And I'll make some lubricant to get rid of that creep vine. It's taking up a lot of space. Lubricant is essential in construction of vehicles and power plants. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, I'll make the titanium too. I don't... Just get rid of that metal salvage. Make some more silicone rubbers. Some more lubricant. I just want to have all this stuff, like, on hand. Or whenever I need it. Cool. Make another knife. More fins. High capacity O2. This is what I need glass for. And silver. I have no idea where to get silver. Probably deep. Deployables. Waterproof locker. Okay, I can make a locker. Uh, well, let's, like... I guess I need the repair tool, right? Because... Secondary systems. Okay, I need the repair tool for that. And I need it for that. Yeah, so we need to make the repair tool. Um... Right, I'm kind of going crazy here. What? I need cave sulfur. Okay, let's go look for some cave sulfur. I guess it's probably going to be inside a cave. Wild guess? That looks like a cave. Kind of, but not really. Hello, boomerang. Oh, no, come here. You're going to go in my belly. More titanium. I think titanium is pretty common. We need to find a cave. This all looks like pretty flat land down there. Not really want it where I want to go. Let me know what you guys think of this gameplay in the comments. If you guys like vibing with me while I play this game, let me know and I'll, I'll keep playing it. Oh, fuck. I keep forgetting. I need air to live. I'm actually enjoying it. I mean, this is like a pretty safe area right now, but... Like, it's really... This game really is something else. And I'm enjoying it so far already. Again, like, I wasn't... Like, I wasn't planning on making this a super regular series. Because it's so different from what I normally do. But, like, just as, like, an off-topic... What? Oh! 
Ow. Okay. Uh, I think those are the sulfur things. The little, the little angry blowy boys that protect the sulfur in the caves. Yeah, that's where the sulfur is. Yep. What was I saying? Yeah, let me know in the comments if you guys want me to continue this series. Sulfur. Because... Yeah, I think it's a nice little change of pace. Shit, I missed every single one of those. Detecting sulfur deposits in the local cave systems. Sulfur is an essential component of the repair tool. It sure is. That's what that's what I'm uh, gathering right now. And uh, you know, it's all it's all content, right? It's extra content for you guys. I wasn't planning on doing like super crazy edits on these videos or anything. Just like, just like a nice easy video for me to put out something for us to uh, enjoy together and just vibe. I thought this game was a good choice, but let me know. Let me know in the comments what you think, because I don't want to keep playing it if you guys don't want to see it. Okay, let's get that. Uh, repair tool made. Personal equipment... Nope. Tools. There we go. Repair tool. Got it. We Gucci. Okay, now... I'll just hotkey that guy... There. Oops. And... Okay. Cool. Repair. Right click. Oh no, I think I might be fucked. Continue to monitor for emergency transmissions from other life pods? Okay, I will. Can I repair this? What is this? It's smoking. It looks like it needs repairs, but I can't do anything. Medical kit forever. Okay, this just pops out medical kits every once in a while, I guess. Repair this. Wow, it's like magic. I feel like I'm in Harry Potter right now. Oh. Geological data. Um, category three: ocean planet, oxygen, nitrogen, atmosphere, extensive biodiversity. Safety warnings may support Leviathan class predators. That doesn't sound good. Water contaminated with high levels of foreign bacteria. Planet is beyond Federation space. Rescue unlikely. Shit. I guess this is a castaway situation. I'm going to have to find my own way out. It's not recommended to explore this environment without hazardous material suits and extensive support apparatus. Okay. Gonna have to make myself some gear. Um, okay, these are like notifications, voice notification logs. Got my gear. Some first aid. Okay. Oh, I think I have an old fish. I'm, uh, uh, I've captured these fish and they're just rotting away in my pocket. <laughs> um, well, okay, let me, let me cook it and I'll just carry it with me. Eat it when I need to. I need some water right now. That's what I need. Neat. But before I go back down there, what else should I build? Flashlight? Habitat builder. That looks advanced. Hmm. Craft some copper wire. Might as well. Wiring kit. Okay. Hmm. Disposable light source, useful for for distracting certain predators. Ooh, that sounds useful. Let's 
Sea Glide. Mobile vehicle bay. So this thing, you hold onto it and it's a motorized thing that makes you swim faster. Sounds cool. I've seen that in action before. So what should I do now? Damn it. Uh, well, I need water. So why don't we just go back down there to... Oh, God. Underwater dark. Don't like that. Maybe I should just build the flashlight. Yeah, maybe that's going to be our next thing. Um, let's find one more... Well, let's find a couple of bladderfish. Kind of want to stock up on water. Here we go. There's a couple right next to each other. Maybe one more. Caution. Continued degradation of the auroras. Drive core. May result in a quantum detonation. That's... To monitor. That's really upsetting. Is that going to kill me? Relax. 30 seconds. Okay, I'm, I'm going away. I'm in your house, I understand. Get one more. I need lots of water. Eh. I do really like the music in this game. It's, uh... <laughs> it really contributes to the vibe. I'm loving it. Okay, let's get some water going. Just carry this shit around with me all the time. I guess... Should we craft a base? Like, the modules for the base need titanium, and we have... We're probably going to have access to a lot of titanium around us right now. I'm just trying to figure out, like, what the order of things to do is. Like, what's what should I be focusing on first? Um, I need water. I'll take a drink of water. There we go. We're all set. Take one of you for later. Uh, is that salvage? Yep. Can I scan it? I can. Or maybe I should be scanning lots of things. Table coral. Uh, each disc is an individual colony of microorganisms filtering the ocean. Okay, well, I'm not going to do that for everything. But, okay, wait, I have the knife now. So, let me... Uh, I'll make that my primary bind. Scanners, number two. Repair tools, number three. I like that. God damn it. So, can I... Oh! Damn it. There we go. So I have to I have to use the knife to cut some things away. It's another piece there. Cool. Well, that's a lot. Contains trace trace precious metals used in computer fabrication. You use these mushrooms to make computers. Okay, cool. This is a weird planet. I don't need to eat right now. I've got a lot of mushrooms. Um, I'll put those in my storage. And you know what? We'll we'll go out looking for more salvage. I think that's probably the play right now. Get some more salvage. Make a base. Uh, yeah, you can have all these. Getting full up. Let's go find some more salvage. There's lots of metal stuff over here. No salvage. I am swimming much faster with those fins. That's nice. Give me those bubbles. Bu 
bubbles! I lost them. <laughs> There's some. Nice. Man, the salvage is huge. It takes up a lot of space. Uh... Oh, here's some. Bank. Yep. Wow. Oh, look at the pretty grass. Oh. Scanner. Okay, so I can... Yes. Scanner room fragment. 30 seconds. Okay, so I find parts like that to scan. And it enables me to craft different things. This biome supports extensive biodiversity and connects to a number of small cave networks. Oxygen. Going. Oh shit. Oh shit. Ugh. That's brutal. Okay, we need the uh, I guess... Mm. Well, we could build the base down there. Right? So, like, the objective, I guess, is just to go deeper and explore farther down. So, I guess either if... Either way, if we build a base or if we build the sea glide, that should be... One of those should be our next step. I'm thinking maybe the sea glide... Yeah. So what do we need for the sea glide? Um, is it in here? Sea glide. Ingredients unknown. Oh, okay. So I guess I have to scan the parts for that. Shit, I need to learn the blueprint first. Oh. Let me know if I'm, like... Well, don't let me know if I'm missing anything. Don't ruin it for me, but... Like, give me a nudge in the in the right direction. I feel like what I'm saying makes sense. But I just don't know. Because I've never played this before. More table coral. So I need to find parts. Scattered parts to scan. So I just have to explore, I guess. Okay, relax. I said relax. I mean you no harm. There we go. A permanent growing colony of micro microscopic organisms. This coral species is adapted to filter carbon dioxide from the environment using the carbon to build the colony and expelling the oxygen special okay. Whatever, I don't care. <laughs> it, it helps me breathe underwater, that's all I care about. I didn't mean to do that. Something gonna come attack me? I stole their eggs. More titanium, sweet. Give me air. Fill me up. Ah. Uh. Okay. Oh, what the fuck? That's disgusting. Oh. That's gross. So I guess that's how they attack you if you get too close, eh? Okay, I'm gonna watch out for the sulfur... The sulfur boys in here. Ooh. Oh. <gasps> oh. Gold. Lead. Silver. Oh! Okay. This is gonna hurt. Oh! You missed me. Thirty seconds. I, I understand. Come on, fill me up, brain coral. There we go. There. There are creatures making some unsettling noises down here. Shuttle bug. Common scavenger at the base of the food chain. Okay, so it's not dangerous. 
Presence may indicate nearby cave systems. Okay, that's good to know. I wonder what's down here. Um, whoa. Oh, damn it. Am I safe in here? No, oh, I guess not. They actually don't do a lot of damage. Or quartz. I think I have a bunch of that already. This is really pretty. Come on. Oh, I guess I should take the sulfur, eh? Oh, oh. God! Where was your sulfur? There it is. So that's kind of a precious thing, precious resource I don't... I'm not gonna see very often. If this is like the only place where you can get it... Give me some more air. I don't want to go up just yet. Bloop. 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 No, we good, we good. Give me more. Fill me up. Hmm. Ah. Oh. Ooh. One more time. One more time. There we go. Yeah. Okay. Let's keep going. Get some more ore. Our inventory's full. Shit. Uh, we do need water. Drink a couple waters. Ew. Sorry, guys. You died for nothing. Get some health. Shit. Now I need air again. Can I... What if... Oh. Congratulations, survivor. You have exceeded your weekly exercise quotient by 500%. <laughs> Okay. That's funny. There's a little bit of humor in this game. Um. Right, okay, so if I eat this thing raw, it'll give me a little bit of food, but take away some H2O. Interesting. I wonder if there's... Can I... I wonder if I can refine, like... An oxygen tank and keep it on me. Wow, that egg takes up a lot of space. Okay, let's just... We'll explore this cave a little more and then we'll go back to the pod. Put all this stuff away. Because we're getting pretty thick with loot. That titanium. Oh! Lead? Lead? Silver! There we go. Silver is easier to find than I thought. It's a little tucked away, but... Not bad. Oh, there's a lot of these brain things around. That's good. Keep my oxygen maxed out. There we go. I like these things. Uh, where are you? Rabbit Ray? That's weird. But kind of cute. Um, there's one of those big... Oh, there he is. Those big things. Um. Wow, it's really pretty. Look at all these glowing fish. Okay, we're full. That's it. Let's go back to the pod. Oh god, even with the fins, it's painfully slow. Just swimming with my hands and feet. I, yeah, I really need the sea glide. That's gonna help us out quite a bit. Maybe... well, I don't know how... I forget already what we need to make that thing. Oh, we need to scan. We need to scan all the parts. Fuck, we can't... We can't make it yet. So we're kind of screwed. But, um, yeah, you know what? I think I'll leave it there, guys. Um, I'm gonna make this, yeah, this first video is gonna be a little bit shorter one. I might do longer plays in the future, like maybe 60 to, I don't know, maybe even 90 minutes. Who knows? But yeah, these are gonna be, like, longer, kind of just chill vibe 
type videos we do on the weekends only. That's That was kind of my thought for these videos. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. And, uh, oh, we can make titanium ingots now. Sweet. And yeah, thanks a lot for watching, guys. Thanks for coming with me on this adventure to Subnautica. This game that makes me feel really uncomfortable, but also makes me, like, really impresses me in a lot of ways. It's so pretty. So pretty. Okay, guys, thanks again for watching. If you did like the video, make sure you like it. Subscribe if you want to see more, and I'll talk to you in the next video. Oh, excuse you. Jesus.